Hello my beautiful Leos, this is your girl Aqua Goddess coming to give you all a general reading. Keep in mind that this reading will be for past, present, future and it may or may not resonate with you. If you're interested in booking a personal reading session with me, you want to purchase any of my manifestation jewelry or artwork, the information will be in the description box below. I've already prayed and meditated over your energy Leo, so we're just going to go ahead and tap right in. Spirit Angels, Ancestors, Guides, please protect me while channeling the messages for the sign of Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Note. Please return all negative energy back to sender 10 million fold. And if you are out there showing me love, much love and light to you. Alright, Spirit, what messages do we have for my beautiful Leos? Self-motivation. Past life connection. The Magician, Financial Increase. Okay. Wow. So the energy that I just picked up for y'all is it's something that y'all are mastering. This could be something very creative, something you do with your hands, whatever the case may be. Um, I'm saying that, believe it or not, like this could be something that you're so good at and people are like, people come to you for this specific for this particular service spirit is saying that you have a past life connection with whatever you're doing at this time so if you're mastering hair art spirituality whatever the case may be this is something that you did in a past life before this is the reason why you're so passionate about it this is the reason why you feel so connected with it this is the reason why it's so easy to express yourself in that manner i'm seeing that whatever this is it's definitely causing a financial increase okay and you're definitely doing everything you can you're using all of the, the tools and resources that you have in order to create new opportunities for yourself so i'm definitely picking up the energy that a lot of you guys work with your hands but you like to create i don't see that you're going to be working for another person for a very long time i see that you're going to be creating your own generational wealth here angel number 222 yes uh, Yes, and you are motivating yourself. A lot of y'all feel like y'all don't even really have a strong support system, but I see you getting it done. I see that you're very determined. You might make a list for yourself, whatever the case is. However you go about it, you get it done. Okay, people trust that when they come to you, their services are going to be great. You know, um, so I, I definitely see that you guys are leveling. Oh, why did I just... Wasn't I just about to say y'all leveling up? Y'all leveling up, Leo. Yes. Money going to be looking good. If you ain't already in a position where you got a side hustle, you are going to have that. I see that you are definitely going to be leveling up financially. This is going to create a lot of ease for you there could be some things that you may have been stressing about some of you guys are even thinking about moving but trying to get things situated to where you feel comfortable and secure with your decisions you know you know like some of y'all are trying to get a new house that's what i'm picking up here i'm saying that you're going to be able to make a lot of things happen here just by your creativity okay so somebody might, uh, they definitely might want to be intimate with, yeah, I see that. And I just heard the thunder here. So you got somebody obsessed with you here. This is someone you may have felt like you know forever. The first time you met this person, they could have felt so familiar. Like, dang, where do I know you from? Or like, like. It's something familiar about you. I can't put my finger on it. This this is somebody that you was connected to in a past life. This could have been someone that you didn't even really have a real relationship with. You could, you may or you may not. But I definitely feel a bond. And I definitely feel a sense of uh, being familiar with this individual. They could like loud music or they could be a musician or this could be you or a truck driver. I'm definitely picking up truck driver energy. 
This truck driver is trying to manifest you back in their life. This is someone that may have blackmailed you at some point. They could have pictures or videos or just did something completely inappropriate when it comes to um, handling you. I'm definitely seeing that this person is putting on a front like they're not jealous. So some kind of way, whether this person is in your energy and you're aware of it, or they're in your energy and you're not aware of it, this person is witnessing you level up. So if you got a platform, if you're a speaker, or whatever you got going on, this person is watching you. They may have not even reached out. I'm picking up the energy of someone you ain't talked to in a while. Okay? And this person probably didn't expect you to level up in the way that you have. But I definitely see that you are... It's like you ain't got nothing to prove to nobody. You're doing this for yourself, for your kids, for your family, if you got kids. You know what I'm saying? Like, or whatever the case may be. But this person tried to manipulate you. Um, you know, this could have been someone that you may have not even had a title with. But they tried to make you feel like you were obligated to act a certain type of way. Or something. I'm picking up some weird energy like that. But this person is jealous. It's a lot of people. And it could be somebody that you recently started talking to. For some of y'all, this person could all of a sudden be distant. You're working on your goals. You're working on some things. And this person is distant at this time. It's because they really jealous, which is weird. I find it always to be weird when somebody's jealous of the person that they're actually being with. Like, that's the weirdest situation for me. But it happens all the time. Like... I'm going to be honest with you. It definitely happens all the time. You could have an internet gangster. Like it could be like a lot of um, people talking mess on the internet. Or whatever the case may be. Somebody is only keeping in touch with you. Because they know that one day they might need something. They don't really love you. Oh my gosh. What is this? Okay. Alright, Spirit, tell me more messages for my beautiful Leos. Moon card. Could be a Cancer or Pisces um, that's putting on the front like they ain't really jealous. This is someone who... <clears throat> this person might have did you so dirty and it's crazy because I feel like you really did love this person a lot like even if y'all was just friends like you got a sense of loyalty for the people that you love and so I feel like this is somebody who did you so dirty they hid so much information from you you know um, you could have been very open and honest with this person or you could have just put them on a pedestal whatever the case may be I'm seeing that this person really only had intentions to use you for your resources and your stability. So this could be somebody that have their own money but still use you for a place to stay. Or this could be, you know what I'm saying? Like this could be any type of situation here. Like like that. Could be a Virgo. Cancer or Pisces. I'm definitely seeing you isolated yourself from this person. You felt like they were immature, especially when it comes to how they handle their emotions. There was a lot of repressed feelings. This person gave you a lot of illusions. Um, they, they just really honestly lied and manipulated for the most part. Alright, yeah, you got the Eight of Cups reverse, Will of Fortune reverse, and you got the Six of Pentacles. So, this person wants to come out of isolation. They want to, they feel hopeless at this time because you've walked away from them. And I'm picking up the energy that, like I said, it could have been years for some of y'all. So, this person, at one point, I feel like you put this person on a pedestal. You respected them so much. You did so much for them that they would have never thought that this connection would just be dry like you know no communication no inter like you're not with it because this person tried to breadcrumb you but they definitely are receiving bad karma this person could have made a lot of money and still kind of tried to breadcrumb you definitely gave you illusions you know made you feel like something was going to be more than what it was or whatever the case may be okay all right Okay. 
somebody got an attitude because you are winning. They, oh, see, I told you luck's on the bottom of the card. This person feel like you too lucky. And it's crazy because things really start happening better for you when you really stop talking to them. And that's always a smack in the face for people. When when you start leveling up, when you're not even dealing with them no more, like, that's something to talk about. Like, not only they be thinking about it, you be thinking about it. Other people like, dang, how long was y'all together again? Like, what happened? Like, why y'all ain't, oh, shorty, like, doing way better. Like, yeah, like that make people feel a type of way and it's making them obsess over you even more. Dominance. Yeah, this is someone that maybe tried to dominate you in some kind of way. This I'm picking up the energy of a very like an overly masculine energy. So this person could have down low stuff going on because there is overly masculine energy with this person yeah so they trying to prove a point they i'm hearing that they were always trying to prove a point could have been a truck driver to try to blackmail you this person's obsessing over you yeah emotions are here so this person really tried to control your emotions they try to make you feel like, like without them, you would be nothing. But I see that you're much better without them. So this person is really, really hurt. Oh my gosh, y'all. Why is truth at the bottom? Why is truth at the bottom? Because it is the truth. Because <laughs> it's the truth. And the spirit is saying you're very knowledgeable. And you're a leader. And you got your self-esteem. You build your self-esteem up since you spoke to this person. This person really could have had you at a, a halt when it comes to your own self-esteem. By certain things that they were doing to manipulate your energy. And to dominate you. Yeah, I hear it. Oh my gosh, I hear sirens and I hear thunder and I hear everything right now. Alright, Spirit. What other messages do we have for my beautiful, beautiful Leos? Okay. So, we have... Moon magic, which Aries got this. Some of y'all could have been dealing with an Aries or a Cancer or a Virgo. Could be any sign. I got Virgo, so it could be a Virgo. Um, need more sleep, so you could be going to sleep late, waking up early, trying to trying to get your 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 dream situated or whatever you're trying to do. You're just on your grind right now. Like I definitely see that some of y'all got a vacation coming up. I don't know if you know this or not, but. <laughs> Uh, you got a vacation coming up, okay? Um, angel number 7070. Angels are congratulating you on your learning, your recognizing, and your achievements. Cancer energy is here. So there's a cancer that feel like you so lucky, or Gemini, that like you just luck, you know, like you're just so blessed. But this is the same person that manipulated your energy and gave you illusions. So this person is definitely obsessing from the background. But I see money looking good. It feels me. So at the end of the day, we ain't even worried about it. You feel me? Everything is working out exactly how it's working out. And I see that you are using all of your tools and resources to manifest your the life that you desire. So you are 100% on the right track. Okay, keep up the great work. Don't let a hater bother you. You feel me? Ain't nothing but just another one. Just add them to the bucket of other haters. You feel me? At the end of the day, we're going to keep on pushing. We're going to keep on leveling up. We're going to keep on doing what we got to do. And at the end of the day, we ain't tolerate. We ain't, we're not going to tolerate anyone that is not supporting us. Anybody giving us illusions or whatever the case may be. This, that's, that's, that's energy in the past, man. Like, we moving forward. You guys are on a whole new journey. Whatever you're doing in a creative kind of way, keep doing it. I'm so proud of you. Like, you really making things happen for yourself. For real, for real. All right? 
So those are the messages that I have for you, my beautiful Leos. If you enjoyed this reading or if it resonates with you, make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. And I will talk to you guys on your next video. Peace.